so my name is Roselle. Alison from Happy Soul recently reached out to me and asked if I'd be happy to share um, my story, my experience um, with Alison um, through the use of emotional freedom technique. So I would like to note that I'm in no way affiliated with Alison on a professional level. This is purely my story, my experiences with her, and I hope that it does help you in some way, whether that is to encourage you to also seek um, professional help and guidance with Alison or that it or that it resonates with you. So um, I reached out to Alison in November 2019 and she was recommended to me by a friend who had also dealt with um, with Alison in the past. Um, so we had a course of eight sessions um, from November 2019 till February 2020. Now I would like to note that I am based in Far North Queensland and Alison is based in Sydney, New South Wales. So all of our sessions were done via online, uh, via virtual, um, on Messenger um, and Zoom. So I reached out to Alison because I was going through a breakup. Um, and that breakup also triggered me to realise that, hold on, I actually need to also address some of the issues, concerns, but also some past trauma that I had never dealt with in the past. I could think of a million reasons as to why I never dealt with them and one of them would probably be that it is one of the most vulnerable um, situations I felt that I could possibly put myself in but it was comforting to know that um, the sessions with Alison were comforting. She was very empathetic but most importantly she let me control the pace that we were going at um, particularly around some sensitive an excruciatingly painful trauma um, that I had experienced previously. So what was really interesting in my first session with Alison was the ability to identify um, some emotions that I had felt um, towards myself, towards my ex-partner, but also towards the situation. I thought I was just going through um, the hurt and the rejection but then, going, but then after our first session, or during our first session, I realised that there were other feelings of guilt, um, but other feelings that I didn't realise that I was feeling at the time. Um, soon after my first session with, with Alison, I felt this immediate sense of relief, this sense of peace, this sense of inner peace, not only towards my ex, not only towards the situation, but also towards myself. And that's when I knew that I was capable of healing, that I was capable of moving on, and that I was capable of also addressing all the issues um, and trauma that I had experienced in the past. And I just felt this, this sense of empowerment. We also worked through um, my experience with, with anxiety and depression and how that has impacted me in terms of my personal but also my working life. Um, after a few sessions um, focusing on, particularly on specific situations where I did feel in anxious, um, I saw m a massive, massive change in my behaviour, in my thought processes, but also importantly in the situations that I found myself feeling incredibly anxious. The feedback that I have received from my colleagues from my friends tells me the significant improvements that they've seen in my personality, in the way that I work, but also my outlook in life. I, I can't stress enough um, how much Alison has, has helped me and how much she has changed my life for the positive um, and for the better. I'm now living more in the present, I'm more living in the moment. But most importantly, I have found that inner peace that I have been searching for. I find that um, there's some things or some situations where I'm no longer triggered. Um, that these emotions that I used to feel are completely, like I've completely dissociated those emotions from a particular situation, from a particular experience, from a particular person. And that is the reason why I feel so empowered, so so confident and um, 
more like me, more like who I really am. Um, and I hope me sharing my story with you um, helps you in some way. Um, and also I hope that it does encourage you to seek help with Alison because I cannot thank her enough for changing my life, for changing my life for the better. So thanks, that's my story. <laughs>